did order it from eBay. I'll try to put a link down, but time to go put it up. Perfect. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. So this is handcrafted by someone, uh, this woman who is a seller on eBay, so she makes these for a lot of friends, obsessed people, so I ordered it. It was like $12, and it looks so great. It only took a couple days to get here, and I am in love. So I also added a pink blanket to this, and the heater should be coming in soon, and I ordered a remote because we don't have a remote for this TV and it's getting annoying. And yeah, that's all I think that's changed. I put the DVDs down here because it is hooked up to a DVD player and I'm just going to throw this away. And I also added a trash can down here and I think that's about it. So yeah, it's coming along. I think I want something on this wall but I'm not quite sure yet because these are just blank and I just want to give it a little more oomph to this room so this is it and I think it's looking pretty good so yeah okay so we got some packages I'm gonna bring them downstairs and open some of them up so this one I actually know what it is already and it's the rest of the photos for my daughter's photo album sorry I just took a nap so it's the rest of the photos that go in here so I'm just gonna keep these up here and I'll do another time-lapse filling in the rest of them because there are like 300 in there but as for these there for the studio so let's do this okay so I've brought the packages downstairs I've got scissors right here and we're gonna open them up okay so this is the new heater and wait I guess this makes it hotter. Oh, so it comes out of here. Well, that's fancy. So I don't know if all of that was in frame, but this is what we got. So we got the new backdrop kit from eBay. So I just had to adjust it a ton of times because it's super long. Didn't want it on the floor, so this is where we've got. It's kind of like basically almost folded in half. This is the five feet. It goes all the way to 10, but obviously I have more things going on. And I have my ring light. I still have lights coming in. We have the unboxing mess. And these poles make it extend. And then I have another backdrop, which is black. Okay, so I just set up the studio downstairs and now I'm going to go through these photos and put them in the album. Okay, vlog, it is like two o'clock and it's Tuesday, April 28th. And I got another package, I got another package, I got another package. Okay, so I'm going to open it up and set it up. Okay, so this is what we've got. We've got softbox one, softbox two, backdrop. Still have to iron that, but whatever. We got a bagel. We got a bagel. 
Hi, Bagel. How you doing? The heater. I have to maybe rethink where this couch is going to be because this is all just very awkward now. Ring light. But yeah, let's see. Wow. Wow. So the soft boxes I got mainly just for photography so it could be softer than the ring light because the ring light is pretty harsh. I know it can be dimmed but I was watching a lot of YouTube videos on lighting for photography and a lot of people like soft boxes just because obviously the white over makes it just softer, hence the word soft box. So I figured try it out. Ooh, my mic. Um, but yeah, I will do some test photos and see how I like them. But I got these off of Amazon for 40 bucks, so I'm not really losing much with it if it doesn't work out. And I still have the ring light and I'll just figure it out from there. But yeah, so far I like them. They're not too bright, but they're bright enough. And yeah. Sorry, I'm looking below because that's where my viewfinder is and I like it. So I'm gonna turn the lights off and let's see. Oh yeah, just got a little, <gasps> oh well. Just got a nice little switch. So that's cool. Let's turn this one off. Boop. Okay, good morning vlog. It is Wednesday, April 29th. And I just got a package, but we have to wait until we get back from the grocery store. We are still on the hunt for formula, so fingers crossed uh, we find it today. So, little Munchkin and I are heading out to the grocery store. I've got my sunglasses on because it's surprisingly really nice outside. I think it's like 50 degrees, Alexa said before I left, and it feels great. I'm in a t-shirt and jeans, like perfect weather. But please excuse my hair because I have all these ugh, dead ends, but it's also not cute enough to like stay down, so I have it in this half up ponytail, but we're not gonna talk about it. We're just not gonna talk about it. So I'm just currently waiting for my car to warm up, and then we're gonna head out, and I'll probably just see you at the grocery store. So we had a success. We got all the formula, and these are just clothes I picked up from my mom's house that I left there. But we got formula. The munchkin's asleep in the back, so I'm gonna go get her. And we just made it home. I think Jimmy's gonna go get food. Oh, wow. I am so smart. I left the car on. got a mat for downstairs just in case no one told you today good morning I believe in you you're doing great nice butt so so I want the studio to be a no shoe zone I can help it so I got a mat for right here so it's just perfectly boop perfect okay so I just transferred the munchkin down into her her crib, so it is 12.22, so she got a late start to her nap. She usually goes down for a nap around 10.30ish to 1.30, it's her first nap. She didn't fall asleep in the car until like 11.40, so I'm thinking I'll let her sleep till 1.30 because I don't want to mess up her sleep schedule too much, but she'll be super cranky if I wake her up at 1. So now that she's asleep, I think I'm just gonna chill out a little bit. I just finished doing the dishes and some basic cleaning around the house and I think I'm just gonna chill on my iPad for a little bit and watch some YouTube videos and I've been working on a new intro and outro I've been trying to figure out like all this like new I downloaded procreate and I'm trying to figure out like cool ways to do thumbnails and everything and I'm still looking into the Canon like 11 to 22 millimeter vlog lens so let me know if I don't know I think I I want a wide angle um, for this camera because I think I just really love the look of it 
because my arm is like super duper extended right now to get this like look and I just want to never worry about me being in the shot and you never have to worry about being in the shot if you have a wide angle lens. So right now I'm using the kit lens which is totally fine. It's a 15 to 45 but I think I just want the wider field of view if you know what I mean. So yeah, I'm just gonna hang out and I mean jeans I put real pants on today I'm so proud I'm wearing a bra and everything so go me and yeah I'm just gonna hang out I think I'm gonna plan some more YouTube videos I planned some already but I have to wait for some more items to come in for me to actually do said video so sort of just the waiting game right now so yeah that's what we're doing got my iPad right here and yeah so we about to do and we're back on the 22 millimeter currently waiting for my 11 to 22 millimeter to show up which was supposed to arrive yesterday thursday may 7th now it's friday may 8th and it said it's going to arrive today now it says it's in transit arriving late even later than before and it was supposed to be my new vlog lens, so, yeah. But, I don't know, I've been watching a bunch of videos on the 22mm, people are trying to vlog with it. it. Looks a little more personal. I personally like wide angle shots, but it's a great lens. Great focal length, it's a f-stop of two. No complaints, I like taking pictures with it about vlogging it's a little you know, like right here and my arm is fully extended we're here we're doing it huh yeah. okay Let's see yeah so I was just taking I think the cool thing about this lens is that everything will be blurred in the background since it's you know a 22 but so great quality really liking it but I don't know if it's for me. I might do like a vlog day in my life with the 22 millimeter because I really like the videos I watched. Oh yeah, I did cornrows last night because I got bored when I saw the shower, but these are because I haven't been putting my hair half up, half down because my hair isn't growing. So it's been cutting off. So I've got all of these little baby hairs, baby hairs, sorry. I haven't done anything about it, but I needed a new way for me to get the hair out of my face. Sorry if I've like left over eyeshadow or eyeliner. Oh, I see a little from this morning, but since we have masks on, I only did my eye makeup today when I went to work. And yeah, I'm back at work. <laughs> Don't know if I said that, but I'm back at work at Starbucks. So yeah, it's been going good. I went back Monday. We opened Wednesday officially. And yeah, business is picking up, but man, masks get hot. So, yeah, maybe I'll take you to Starbucks. Oh, I hear Jimmy. Um, but yeah, this is my camera bag. I've got to do an updated camera bag. I know I just did one, but I got some new toys in here. So, um, I sold some things, bought some things, and I still have to do the studio room tour downstairs, but still figuring out things but it's almost like around seven o'clock so we're at the home stretch of nuggets bedtime and yeah we're just enjoying life so i will i've got a lot of vlog clips on this memory card that i just found so i'm gonna see if i can turn a vlog. we gotta go 